As long as vaccination doses remain limited, the world cannot rely on vaccinations to flatten the pandemic curve. So said Director of the Pan-American Health Organization, PAHO, Dr. Carissa Etienne. While vaccination doses remain limited, the director noted that there are three priority areas that remain critical in controlling the spread of COVID-19 in the region. The first is to ensure equitable access to the tools, both new and old, to prevent and treat COVID-19. We must ensure that health workers have the protective gear and equipment that they need to do their job safely and that every person who requires hospitalization can access the basic medications they need, ISOE beds if, if that is necessary, to manage and treat the conditions. This is especially challenging as cases surge and supply chains are strained. With the arrival of vaccines, we must ensure not just that doses are produced quickly, but they are equitably delivered and swiftly across every country, regardless of income. This, Dr. Etienne explained, will require global and regional collaboration and solidarity with donors, pitching in resources through mechanisms like the COVAX facility. Another priority area is the quick action by leaders in the region to foster unity. This pandemic has taught us time and time again that leadership determines the effectiveness of a country's response. As we look to the year ahead, leaders will face difficult choices as we work to flatten the transmission curve. And that's why we need leaders to act transparently so that the public understands their decisions and the scientific evidence that is behind those decisions so we can rally people around a shared plan. We need leaders to act in the interest of public health, not political gain, by working together to make the best use of the tools to prevent this virus. Dr. Etienne assured that PAHO remains committed and stands ready to assist all countries in the region in the fight against the coronavirus. We don't have much time to lose, but we cannot beat the pandemic without strong vaccine delivery plans. And that's why PAHO is working with every country in our region to help secure the vaccine doses that countries need to protect their populations. We're also providing support with vaccine demand planning, logistics and cold chain management, surveillance and information system strengthening, health worker training, and vaccine communicating, communication planning, among others. Director of PAHO, Dr. Carissa Etienne, speaking at the first media briefing for the year 2021.